Hi, this is Shane and welcome back to another episode of the Popular Fiction Legacy Challenge. And, oh, there you go. Harrison's in the shower. And Liberty is just enjoying life. She is pregnant. She is currently in her second trimester. Yep, she's in her second trimester. Did they get married? I can't remember. I honestly cannot remember. Relationships. They're acquaintances. Okay. Because, I mean, their friend meter is all the way up. But I think it's, um... Yeah, not quite sure what's happening there. Alright, Harrison, come downstairs. He's very dapper. And he's starting to work. Let's... Let's join him. Because Liberty is... She's going to be going into work, but there's not much to do with Liberty, to be honest. It's Harrison, we have to get his skills up and stuff. I don't think it's her day off. So we'll leave her alone and we'll join Harrison at work because he needs to, um... He needs to progress through the Doctor career. Okay, is it raining? Do they still get the whole I'm burning moodlet? No? Okay. All right, swab a patient. Oh, do we have to go through all of this again? Keep swabbing patients. What level is he at? Two or three? He's at level four. So I would have thought he would have been doing more than just swabbing patients and stuff. Okay. All right, we don't know. Are these people who all diagnose, who all need to be diagnosed? Uh, swab for sample. Check their ears. And what else? And run tests. Okay. Scanning the x-ray machine. A weak diagnosis is available. Okay, so I guess that's the um that's the benefit of being level four. Is that we can now di diagnose patients. Um let's see what's going on. Okay, to get a promotion, we need to successfully diagnose and treat a patient. What's he doing? Oh, I thought he was playing Space Invaders or something. Like when they deliver the babies and they do the whole Stork Invaders thing. Okay, possible ailment. More examinations might be needed. Okay, um, where is the treadmill? Alright. Poor little Billy. Um, compelling diagnosis? Starry eyes. Okay. Take temperature. Although that's the only thing that's coming up. So should we make the compelling diagnosis of starry eyes? Okay, and we need to treat her. Nope. Examine patient. Medical referral. Nope. Treat patient. Starry eyes with meds. 
She's killed, yay! Alright, so we've done that. Next child. Examine. Swap a sample. Uh, medical referral. Oh, children can't do the treadmill test. Okay. Okay, let's run it in the chemical analyzer. Let's do that then. Um, analyze patient sample. From Billy? No, we want orange Bailey Moon. Is that a paw he has? He has um shaved into the side of his head. Yeah, is that like some sort, some kind of secret secret um pet gang? I've never seen that hair before. I have never seen that hair before. That's quite strange. Okay, uh, run tests, analyze the sample. Yeah, he's confused and we'll need to do more tests. Examine, um, scan body. Liberty's off to work. Weak diagnosis. Nope. Where are we? Salmon patient. Medical referral. Refer for x ray scan. Oh, he's happy being in the rain. Okay. That's good. At least somebody enjoys the rain. I don't. And what else do we need to do? Come on, Harrison. And okay. Compelling diagnosis llama flu. Okay, so we think that Orange Bailey Moon has llama flu. You better not be wrong, because you know he's a he's a child of a celebrity. His dad's not going to be very happy. Okay, so we need to treat treat your llama flu. Okay, we've got a good one. Are there any adults? They're all kids. I want an adult. I want to run a treadmill test. Alright, well, there's Clara. Oh, is she ill? No. More choices. I mean, yeah, obviously she's ill. But do I not get the option to... Oh, there you go. Admit her to a bed. I can swab her for a sample and then perform a treadmill test. Because she's an adult. And only adults can run on treadmills. Children can't run on treadmills. I don't know why. You'd think they'd have like an automatic booking system. Are we there already? Okay. Um, medical referral, admit to exam bed. Not sure what happened there. Let's extend his day, stay late. And we've got her, we can swab her for a sample. Um, swab for sample. Um, 
Medical referral, refer for treadmill test. Because we only have... We have about two hours. And of course in Sims time, that's going to be forever. Because it takes them an hour to get across the hospital. And I'm pretty sure if you're ill, the last thing you want to do is run on a treadmill. But then The Sims isn't known for their realism when it comes to um to hospital stuff. Because, I mean, look at the babies. You get to lie in a machine and, you know, they take the baby out your side. Oh, God. What happened there? So, yeah. So, The Sims is not exactly known for their realism. But there you go. Because I'm patient. Uh, right. Go back to the bed. And of course he's on his phone. Alright, Clara, where are you? Um... Examine patient, check her eyes. So run tests. Okay, so diagnose needs to be unlocked. I don't think we have. Okay. And now we can diagnose her. Yeah, but we still don't know what it is. X-ray scan. Come on, we don't have a lot of time. I know you're sick and stuff, but you know. You can hustle it across the hospital. Or maybe what they should have is orderlies with wheelchairs. And they take you across the hospital, because that's what they do in real life. Ah, uh, what time is it? We may or may not get her diagnosed before his time runs out. I don't know, it's a it's touch and go. Compelling diagnosis is still It's still not giving me a good diagnosis. Harrison, get off your phone. I'm pretty sure we can check her. Oh, there you go. We didn't get one. Maybe the next day, if I send him in and tell him to work hard, he might be able to get one. I don't know. Do we have any mail? No. Okay, vampire. We need to get his vampire law. Because that's got 15 levels and he's at, what, level 11? Yep. Um, read. Vampire 3. Because you're in good shape. Does he have the speed reader treat? Does that actually... No, he doesn't. Does that actually do anything, though? The speed reader thing? Because I've heard, like, conflicting reports as to whether it actually works or not. Um, let's see. Speed reader... Are you reading? You're not reading. Harrison. Alright, now he's at level 12. He can craft the... Ca that was quick. Maybe the speed... I've never seen speed reader go that fast. Um, now he's unlocked... Uh, the ultimate vampire tome. Okay. Purchase ultimate. We have enough, barely. And it sounded like Liberty got a promotion. Command center lead. And that's what level? Level four, not too bad. 
Okay, so... Oh, that's sweet. She's saying, I want food. He's saying, you stink. But he will still give her a kiss. Alright, well, Harrison, you go and cook. Go cook for Liberty. Um, and Liberty, you go upstairs. And you take a shower. And she's also very tired. Which doesn't really surprise me. Was that a cabbage he had or was that watermelon? I don't know. I don't know why I... It's the Sims. They always have something. I know she's passed out somewhere. Not a good look, Liberty. Alright, we'll put that in the fridge then. And then... Harrison, you can read. I did buy it. Is it in his inventory? Um, yes. Read that. I have never seen... Well, maybe that's one of his vampire... Vampire things, because, I mean, that's going up pretty fast. That is going up really fast. That... No! Harrison! Alright, did... Does that need? No, it doesn't need. Alright, where is... Uh, no, that's not it. Is that it? No, that's volume one. Where's it gone? Okay, seriously, where did he put that book? Because that's love in the... No, no, that's Lucas. Lucas Dark. Uh, one, two, and three. Oh, there it is. Alright, you literally have... Just one... Just... It's, it, I've... I wonder if that's a vampire thing. Right, so we've done that. That is awesome. The ultimate vampire cure. But we don't need that. So, do does that now mean that we can... Okay, for a minute I thought his, his needs had... Um, because it because that is in the yellow I'm thinking that doesn't look right okay so liberty yeah liberty you come downstairs and get some food what time is it? it's five in the morning all right so we can tick that off the list are you going to talk to liberty chat with her to keep her company I thought she was going to stand up the entire time. Oh. It's love day. He wants to do all that stuff. I guess she's not feeling very loved up because she's uncomfortable. And the baby and... She's about to go into the third trimester. Okay, Harrison, where are you? At least they're still hugging, which is good. Why are you still uncomfortable, Liberty? Oh, from the baby. 
Right, she can now take family leave, which is good. Harrison, what time do you start work? No, that's Liberty. Two hours. Well, we can do some Love Day stuff. Um, ask to fill the baby. Um, pick up line. Okay, they like that. That's cool. Do I have any flowers I can give her? Um, household. Order stuff. Oh, I forgot I had this Sims loot box. Let's order one. But that's not what I wanted. See, I'm getting distracted. Getting distracted by the by the shiny. Okay, phone, um, purchase gifts. Show all gardening. Let's get three roses. Uh, give love day gift. A rose. Ask baby's due date. You didn't want a rose? Who doesn't want a rose? He loves you. Did you ask her the due date? I don't know. Oh, God, really? Okay, let's join him. Okay, hopefully we can get a promotion today. There's Clara. We still haven't worked out what she has. Uh, check ears. No, that isn't Clara. Ah, okay. Definitely not Clara. I saw blonde hair. He was sitting in the same place. And I was like, yeah, that's got to be Clara. No, it's not Clara. That's somebody else. It's a good thing I'm not a doctor. Um, take temperature. Swore for sample. Nope. Um, examine. Check eyes. What else? Perform a treadmill test. And examine patient, solve for sample. Because as a level 4 doctor, he still can't swab for a sample. He should be able to do that in his sleep, to be honest. Uh, let's see. Well, he's running pretty good for a, for a sick guy. Until he fell off the treadmill. But I think the treadmill threw him off on purpose. Okay. And has the pharmaceutical lab has overtasked and sent a batch of confidential tissue samples that recur an urgent analysis. Please collect the samples from the reception desk for immediate evaluation and data recording. Okay, we can do that. Get uh, get samples. Uh, 
Hopefully that might be able to give him the raise that he needs. Okay, uh, test them at the chemical analyzer. And that's got to be it. That's the only thing that he has that needs analyzing. And the Dr. Maruko. He's still her friend, right? Nope. Wasn't she the woman they were talking to? No, it was Dr. Megan before. Um, what? I thought he was analysing the samples. I don't understand that he was analysing the samples before. Or maybe that just dropped out of his queue, I don't know. Okay, so we've analysed it. Oh, we did do it. Do we have to... Uh, what computer enter them into... Or maybe he did do it and do they only have the one computer? We can't even fix it. She's not even using it. Woman, get up. You're not even using it. Do they only have the one? Oh, there's another one. Uh, record that. I've never noticed that other computer behind there. Okay, let's do that. Um... Go to work. Okay, we've done that. You grab something to eat and then we go back to Jeffrey Landgrab. It was Jeffrey or Malcolm? Whichever land grab. Jeffrey. Uh, guaranteed diagnosis. Sweaty shivers. And now we need to treat his illness. Um, more choices. Treat patient. Sweaty shivers. Right, Mr. Langrab, with your top hat money, you can go. And you're not even going to change. Well, I guess when you're, when you're rich, you don't have to worry about changing out the hospital gown. You just get into your into your limo and go home. Alright, let us swab for a sample. Um refer for X ray scan. What time is it? It's three. Okay, we might be able to diagnose this patient before he finishes work. Okay, Harrison, keep going. Keep going. I'm not sure why there was the big pause right in the middle. Who's that? Oh, Lester Carlson. Okay. Okay, we'll see what we... We'll see how it goes, because it is love day. Although I'm not quite sure what time Liberty finishes. Because we just need her to do a couple of interactions on love day. And then she would have, at least she's not going to get the sad moodlet. Okay. Uh, compelling diagnosis. Bloaty head. Okay. And we can treat you with a shot. Okay. 
Can we look at anybody else? I think so. Next person. Now it's Olivia Kim Lewis. Uh, all these kids. What's what? Is there some kind of um? Examine patient. Uh, swab for sample. I oh, know. It took him an hour <laughs> to decide that he's gonna move. All right, stop burning. We don't need any twinkly vampires. And Liberty, what time do you finish work? Till 10. Yeah, we still got another five hours. Well, we can work on the, um, on his pipe organ. Practice. There's Dr. Megan. Should we go to her house? Actually, let's go to Megan's house. Fountain View Penthouse. Ooh, swanky. All right, well, I'm pretty sure that's not where you're supposed to be. For a doctor, I mean, yeah, she's got the penthouse. But obviously, um, she doesn't have... Hasn't got the money to put anything in the penthouse. Okay, let's get you to... Throw Love Day confetti. Although if he does that to her, does that... Does she... Yeah, he just shot her right in the chest with, with Love Day confetti. But yeah, that's... um. I'm pretty sure that's 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 the doctor that we like. Um <laughs> friends work. Yeah, it's her. Yep, that's her. Harrison, what are you do oh he's using the the talking toilet. Converse. Because here we can kill some time until Megan comes home. Megan? No, wrong person. Until Liberty comes home. Although, to be honest, Harrison, you didn't come here to sit and talk to the computer. Maybe if he talks to her and gets her to um, put in a good word, he can... Um, Oh, should he offer to turn her? I just saw that as a... Friendly, I just saw that. Offer to turn. I want to see what happens. I guess she wants to be around a bit longer. I wonder how many people in town Harrison can turn. Because I, because I mean, he turned. Um, uh, Don Lothario and some other guy last week, didn't he? Cool. I wonder, can you keep track of all the people that you turn? I gave him powerpoints. Not enough, th oh. Vampiric charm or speed? Um, charm, strengths, or command. Although it conflicts with vampire aura, does he have that? Um, what is vampire aura? Um, no, we don't want vampire. Well. We'll do that one. 
we'll do that one. But yeah, there must be a way to to keep track of all the sims that you turn. Oh, Liberty's at home. Why is she at home? She doesn't... I thought she didn't finish work till... No, I thought she finished work at 10. All right, well, in that case, you can go home, Harrison. Oh, look. why is she there? I don't know why Liberty turned up there. That was... Oh, God, now she's collapsed somewhere. Is she out in the street? What? <laughs> I don't believe this. I really hope she's having a human baby and not a vampire baby. I don't know if I can go through another pregnancy with her. Oh, she collapsed in the house somewhere. Probably in the lift. Okay, so let's do a couple of Love Day things. Um, Give Love Day gift. Although he's probably not going to like it because that's the rose that you get, he gave you. Nope, yeah, he didn't like that. Um, share the love day spirit. Flirt. Although you're probably not feeling very flirty. Seeing you're the size of a house. Kiss. I don't know, they do romantic socials and they both have minus minuses. Although they like that one, I don't know. Um Is it because he's a vampire? They're both going to sleep. Why is he embarrassed? Maybe they're not meant to be together. What? Oh, really, Harrison? Okay. Well, anyhow, she got okay. You can go and practice. And I don't really want to finish the episode until Liberty gives birth because, you know, she's ready to pop. Alright, you're up. Why are you up? Because you need to wee. Alright, so she's sleeping. Maybe I should get them a more a more comfortable bed. Um, okay. I just need you to keep practicing. Still got four more levels. It's going to take forever. Okay, uh... Love Day is over, it was pretty good, Love Day was awful. Okay, so does that mean then she gets the sad? Yes, she does. That is annoying. Although, I mean, she was pregnant. She wasn't in the mood for Love Day. Alright, you can stop practicing, get something to eat, go take a shower, and let's see if we can get Liberty to hurry up and have the baby. Because Liberty, we can't finish the episode until you have a baby. That's the rule. He's painting, okay, well he's inspired, that's good. Is he going into work today? Uh, no, he's not. 
So why couldn't Love Day be today? Oh, it's taught like a pirate day. Well, that's that's the day they can do they can get that without even trying. That's a nice picture. And let's put that up on the wall. Yeah, frame canvas. It's a pity you can't put any other colours of frames. Liberty? No. Yep, she's gone into labour. So are we going to have a boy or a girl? Oh, we need a bassinet to to have the baby at home. And now I think about it, we haven't even decorated any of the rooms either. Oh dear, I wasn't thinking about that. Yep, we have a bassinet. And let's see what... Okay, Liberty, could you be... At, well, then again, she's in pain. I didn't think... I'd, she's not really going to move very fast. Let's see what we have. Oh, we have a girl. What are we going to call her? Uh, let's randomise it, because I don't know. Precious? No. Beatrice? No. Amaya? 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 Yeah. No. Susan? <laughs> I don't know. Christine, Tammy, Melanie, Francis, Katrina... Precious again. They really want us to use Precious. Nicole, Karina, Karina, Karina Lee. All right. But she's going to be Montana Lee. Oh my God. <laughs> I wasn't expecting twins. Well, if you've got Karina, we've got Corin. Uh, Liberty, I don't know if that's your genes or Harrison's, but we've now got two of them. Right, where's the other baby? Is it downstairs? No, in the bedroom? In the bedroom. Okay, so... Okay, twins. I was not expecting that one. I was not expecting that one. We've got twins. Oh my god. We have twins. Well, you want them in like identical. Well, not. I, I want them in another bassinet. I want the other. Uh. Function. Kids, bed. I want the other vampire crib. All right, Harrison, you pick up. Yeah, you pick up your son. Pick him up. Uh, all right, let's get rid of D. 
delete. No, it can't be deleted. Alright, well, oh, really? It's not going to let me put the baby in there, is it? Bottle feed. Yeah, that is attached to the baby. It's not going to let me... Alright, well, never mind. Yeah, it's not going to let me switch out the bassinets. Which is a shame. Uh, bottle feed. Uh, Corin, yeah, Corin is upset. Yeah, feed him. But then we want to find out if they're vampires or not. I am st I'm so tempted to just age them up. To see. Can you tell from their eyes? Well, her eyes are closed. His eyes are open, but you can't tell. All we need to know. I'm going to age them up. We're going to age them up. Right, Harrison. Right, age up. Age up. Because we need to find out if we've got vampires or humans. Oh, she looks so cute. Oh, she's human. She's human. She doesn't have the little vampire thing. Age up is... Age up. Uh, Alright, Liberty. I oh, know he's going to do that. What on earth is... What is she dressed in? Oh, it's a skirt. And they're both human. Corin and Karina are both human. Although they've got, it looks like they've got their dad's skin. Corin has got his dad's eyes. Are we sure they're both human? Yep, they have... Yeah, they're both human. They don't have the little vampire tab down here for their needs. Okay. So, we have twins. And they're both human. Which is awesome, because we need a human child for the next generation. And as for who's going to be the heir, I don't know. I would usually put it as the firstborn, but we'll see how it goes. We will definitely see how it goes. We've got post. We will see how it goes. Okay, so. Thanks very much for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. It really helps to grow my channel and I love reading your comments. And I will see you guys in the next episode where we we have twins. I still can't believe I was I was not expecting twins. Oh, we got plasma packs. Yeah, he got plasma packs. But I wasn't I definitely wasn't expecting that. So, yes, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.